Okay, it's that time of year where I really feel like my skin needs a little reset, a little refresh. So I'm gonna show you some of my favorite products that I'm, I've been loving lately for this time of year. I'm going to start with this Skin Design Face Bath. It's a very nice cleanser. It's an English brand. And it feels really gentle. I like the jelly um, consistency and it leaves the skin feeling really soft and supple. And I'm, I'm never a big fan of the skin feeling strict. I always like it to feel that it's soothing. Everything I look for is active and soothing. I don't, I'm not looking for anything to be aggressive because I have rosacea, you know. So this is a really nice cleanser and I like to give myself a little bit of a, you know, facial massage since I'm not getting any type of facials lately. I'm gonna rinse my face quickly. I'm gonna use my Derma Flash. You have to have water on your face. But one side, you're able to remove, you know, any sort of blackheads and large pores. And it's, it actually, I felt a significant difference and my pores were much smaller the first time I used it. So I, now I do it every week. And then after that, I like to go over, then you're able to help the product penetrate much better using the light technology. Starting, it's so whenever you feel that it's getting dry, just add the water. So just go over any intuitive areas where you might have a large pores. Do you see how it's kind of smoking? It's crazy. And you will get some redness. Just from that But there's nothing that feels better than cleaning your pores. So then, now I'm going in with my mother's serum. How cute is that? GW, I love that. Oh, this serum is so soothing. It smells really subtle, but fresh. And next up, Cami Fender. So this is her repair balm. And I don't really have any kind of set rules on application. I just kind of do what's intuitive and what f my skin feels like it needs. This also feels very nurturing and hydrating. The texture is rich but light. And I personally am of the school of thought that the more kind of massage and circulation you offer your skin, the better it is. I also really love plant milk, Tammy Fender's plant milk. So I have a few drops of this. And I don't, you know, always do as many steps, but I really want to show you on days that I do take this many steps, it feels so good and you wake up and your skin feels more supple, it feels firmer, it feels brighter and tighter and more hydrated. I always like to get my jawline. Because really your your skin is your canvas. And then we have this, oh my gosh, Ranava is such a gorgeous brand. I'm such a huge fan and I love this cream. This is the Bakuchi cream and it's super duper satisfying to put on. It's so rich. Oh my God, I love this cream. I, I would wish I could take a bath in this cream. I rarely use eye cream full transparency because I tend to use all of the other creams and products over my eye, except for if it's anything that's too oily, then I don't. Then I avoid the eye area and anything fragrant. And oh, this roundabout hand cream. How cute is this? It's so pretty. Don't forget your hands. I mean, the amount of hand washing, we definitely need to invest in really hydrating hand creams, really reparative. Okay, so now, because 
my skin feels really clean and fresh. I just want to have a little coverage. So I'm going to use my Vital Skin Foundation with my Spot Check brush just to kind of get those little areas that feel, you know, too, too red. And I'm using Vital Skin 3. And I will actually use Vital Skin 2 also um, just to pick up any kind of areas that I find too dark or, you know, that where I want to have more coverage and more even skin tone. Here under my nose, I tend to be a little bit red always. So I'm kind of mixing two and three quickly. More like a fresh, I just had a facial. That's how my skin feels. I need a little bit of shape in my face, a little bit of warmth. So super loaded tinted highlight in Pot de Peche with my blender brush. I'm just finding my cheekbone. I am definitely someone who I feel like I always need some element of warmth when I'm just completely pale. My skin tends to feel very green or something. We want to look as healthy as we possibly can. Then I'm going to go in with baby chicks, and pop it, this little pop of color, just using my fingers today. Give yourself a little flush. And then the super loaded tinted highlight just really feels like it's part of your skin. It's part of your DNA. It feels, you know, like it could be your skin. And then it's super radiant and healthy. All of these beautiful products doing their work. And of course our products are packed with active ingredients which is always nice to know. Lit Up has grape extract that is really amazing for tightening your skin, brightening your skin, Berry Flux Vita for antioxidant. Um, okay, so I'm just going over, just exaggerating that luminosity. So I, I have to admit, you know, when I've, Whenever I've had to wear makeup right after having an incredible facial before having my own line, I used to think, oh no, I don't want to clog my pores. I don't want to mess anything up. But because our products are so clean and they're so infused with these active skincare benefits, these ingredients that are so good for your skin, it feels good to, to put on my makeup. And it's, you know, continuing to do the work. It's calming and soothing my skin. Vital Skin Foundation, we have Phytophingosteen, which is incredible for redness and inflammation. Camellia Oil, which protects you against pollution so you can go outside and feel that your skin is protected. Vegetable Squalene, which is for long-term hydration. And of course, Coconut Oil, which is an amazing cell regenerator. So maybe I'll just give myself a tiny bit of pop it on my lips. I love this chamomile um, facial tonic. So refreshing to seal everything. Feels really like a nice touch. And then something else that I'm a big fan of is the new Co Functional Fragrance. This is the Forest Lungs, and this makes me feel so calm all day. Whenever I feel like I have a big meeting and I'm nervous, I just pop on some of my Forest Lungs. So that's, that's my skincare reset. What are some of your favorite recommendations, skincare, supplements, anything? Please let me know. Thank you so much for watching and be well and be safe. Bye.